Hi, I'm Mike Bartlett. I'm the president of Vital Art and Science Incorporated and one of the founders. We have been working for five years to develop a new home vision function monitor. It's aimed at people who have already been diagnosed with either age-related macular degeneration or diabetic retinopathy. These are the two diseases that account for most of the world's blindness. We are trying to develop the first home vision diagnostic that patients can use at home to monitor their own disease progression. Uh, there's almost nothing worse than losing your eyesight. And for people diagnosed with one of these diseases, that they know they're on a downhill slope. Uh, the nice thing is, is that therapies have been developed in the last five years that are effective, but they need to know when to get to their doctor. Unfortunately, the Medicare uh, insurance just doesn't pay for those patients to go to the doctor often enough, and so home monitoring is really needed. The current standard of care is a paper chart like this. They're virtually free. The doctor hands one to the patient when they're first diagnosed with the disease. We have lots of studies that show they're just not effective and most patients just won't use it. We've produced a vision function test that is run on the cell phone. It's intuitively easy to use. Three circles, one of them's distorted. We start off with a large distortion, touch the one that's, that's different, keep going, as you get this, if you correctly make the selections, the distortion gets smaller down to the point where you can just barely see the distortion, not see it. And within 60 to 90 seconds, we can perform an effective test of your vision function capability that it is as accurate as most of the tests in the clinic at detecting small changes in your vision function. Winning this award is important to me and to Vital Art and Science because we've really benefited from a lots of support around this community. It's been great to, for us to work with the Retina Foundation of the Southwest, UT Southwestern Medical Center, UT Dallas, UNT Health Science Center. It's important to us to give back to the community and to basically say thank you to them for helping us get as far along down this path as we have. And we certainly want to recognize that we couldn't have gotten here without the support of the local community and the skill set that's really available here.